Welcome back to the season finale of the My Manager Career with Man United. First up, going for the Premier League title against Arsenal, one of the top clubs in the Premier League. So it's going to be a tough match. We win this, we walk away with the trophy. Now, it's not the only trophy we're hunting for in this episode. We've got the FA Cup coming up, as well as the Champions League final. Uh, so there's some big matchups coming up in this episode. Hope you enjoy. Make sure you like and subscribe if you enjoy the content. And we'll kick off into this one. We're going to go with Rashford holding up front. And obviously Williams and Rafinha on the wings. They have been phenomenal for us this season. In tremendous form. Uh, so that's going to be our attacking four. And then obviously Fernandez, Kemavinga and Casemiro in the middle. Martinez, Shalotabek and Tapsoba in the back. And then Onana between the post. Now let's get into this matchup. Quick start would be the best ideal way. Along with the ball. Back to Rashford. Gets on the outside here. He's got a bit of pace here. Does a move. Takes a shot. What an opener. The man, the myth, the legend, Rashford, has been phenomenal for us this season. Uses his pace and strength. Outside the box and absolutely belts it into the left pocket. What a start. What a fantastic play there by Rashford, but we're not done yet. Holland through to Rashford. He'll chip over the top. And Kamavinga gets the second, 12 minutes in. What a pickup he's been. The stats don't show that he does a lot with only five goals, one assist. But he has been tremendous in the middle of the field with Casemiro well, holding down the again, forward. And all you can do is admire the skill. That's a lot of the cutoff plays are outside. by him or Casemiro. It's good to see him get a goal. Nice goal there as well. It's a poor Fantastic effort. start. 21 minutes in now. Clearance by Arsenal. Odegaard with the ball. Yuri and Timber. The Timber. And the ball with Davies. Davies. What a guard to Ross. Dancing, yeah, so we've got to get in front of him. Just giving him way too much time to here. He's going to find an open teammate. He does. Jesus. Jesus. Oh, off the post. Oh. Martinelli there just there for the ricochet. And Arsenal pick up their first. 2 1 now, 27 minutes in. Well, as you can see, he's give him enough the time there. Rice is going to find an open teammate. That's an excellent finish. And Timber and the ball with Alfonso Davies, Davies with a long ball through Martinelli. Martin Odegaard, Odegaard. Oh, we cut him off there. Challenge. Nice play by Fernandez. Beautiful ball. pass there by Williams. Oh, oh. To <laughs> off the top and post. The we got it back here. Williams crosses into the box. Cleared. Kemavinga. Oh, Holland with the bicycle kick. Gives us the two point advantage. What a goal. Tries a sneaky chip earlier off the top bar. And then what a goal there. Gives us a two point cushion here. The connection, the accuracy, that's a great goal. Beautiful goal there. And again, Kamavinga getting involved. Second assist. On to Jorginho. Jesus now with the ball. We cut him off there with Martinez. Kamavinga. Rafina. Nice long ball through to Rashford. Rashford. Steps back on the inside. Nice play. Sets himself. Give that man that much space. He's gonna make you pay. 32nd goal of the season. All one. Basically got our hands on the trophy now. Ready to celebrate. What a season it's been. Nice goal there by Rashford. Definitely didn't think at the start of the season, by the end, we'll be lifting this trophy, but here we are. Up 4 1. Not over yet. That looks a really entertaining game. Two good teams with two excellent coaches. Again, in front of here, nice cut off there by Schlotterbeck. Kamavinga gets the ball through, but he pulled past there. But Fernandez does get the ball. We've got plenty of time, so we can't let off the gas just yet. But it feels good to be up for one against Arsenal. 
didn't think that was going to happen at kickoff. Ball into the middle. Well, they had a out. Of that ball in. Casemiro's back there. A little chip over the top to Camavinga. Unfortunately. Arsenal do get the ball away here. Liba. 83rd minute now. Williams with the ball. Got Holland on the outside. Running room galore for United. Rashford doesn't use him. Does. Rashford. Ball back to Camavinga. It's still alive. Ramsdale with the block. Into extra time now. This should be it. Last chance. We we'll get a bit of icing on the cake here. He's driven in Into the, the middle. And Ramsdale cuts and it off. The but there we have it. Season one. Premier League winners. Raise that trophy, boys. That is phenomenal this the season. Will soon be theirs. Well, it's been a long wait, but it's worth it. Celebrating in front of their own fans. They've been excellent this season. Martinez absolutely been to be the champions. A man on fire in that back line this season. If you've watched the episode, you know he's been a pillar in that defence. Obviously, we've added Shalotovic and Tapsoba to be on the outside of him. But him in the middle, he's been a man that's been possessed and really gave us a chance to actually win this Premier League. He stopped a lot of chances. And obviously, Casemiro doesn't get a lot of praise with obviously his assist or goal scoring. But again, defensively, he's been great. Here we have it. Premier League winners. And United. Absolutely not. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been brilliant throughout the tournament. Celebrate it with the fans. It's our double domestic there. We win the FA Cup. It's a treble domestically. But of course, going for the four. We want that Champions League as well. Celebrate with the fans here. At home. Really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. Herrera is great to see him there celebrating. He's been a great signing for us as well. And now they get ready. And there we have it. Oh, the with the picture. The with the trophy. Bit of a long celebration, but it's been a long season. You gotta be, gotta enjoy this. But before we get into the uh, FA Cup match, obviously we've won the trophy now. So um, we're gonna just quickly sim through the last two matches of the season. So we will go against Newcastle here. We do lose it against Newcastle, unfortunately. Zero. Uh, nil the one uh, and then we've got Brighton and it's a 3-3 draw here a loss and a draw to end the season but you know we won that trophy that's what the main thing that's what mattered so we're going to go into that uh, second match of this episode now which will be against Liverpool We've got the FA Cup. What a team Liverpool is this season. See, they're in some tremendous form as well. So this is going to be a tough match here. But we're going to go with the same squad that just won us the, the Premier League. Rashford, Holland up front. Williams, Rafinha on the wings. Camavinga, Fernandez, and Casemiro in the middle. Hope you're enjoying this episode. Make sure you hit that like button as it does help the channel grow. If you're new around here for all the latest, make sure you do subscribe. This is going to be an epic match up here against A Liverpool. To etch your name in folklore. Who's it going to be? Only two teams left in the battle for the FA Cup. That can Let's be try and get this winner. domestic trifecta. The treble. <laughs> Face man 
Manchester United, and it's live on EA TV. Here we go, kick off. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson. Jones with the ball, Kim Finger trying to slot up and defend. A lot of back sliding across on Salah, nice defensive play. Martinez, Rudy Rashford, nice long ball through to Holland. Does have Williams with him, steps back in, ball to Cameron Finger, finds Rafina here. Blows it down though, Rashford with the ball, and unfortunately shot blocked. We're going to be going into a corner here. Into the middle. Oh, taps over. Goes for the bicycle kick. Couldn't deliver. And we're going to try to slow down the play here. Seller with the ball. Nice block there by Martinez. Again, such a wall in that back line. Holland through to Rashford. Steps back on the inside. Nice play. Takes a shot. <sighs> Saved by the keeper. 18 minutes in. What a save. Quick hands there. Reaction. Corner here now. Gets it into the box. Cleared out here to Camavinga. Takes a shot. <laughs> Saves it again. Oh, we need this one goal. Get a bit of an advantage here. On ball through Salah. He's dangerous in the middle. Finds Darwin. Nunes. Oh, you're kidding me. Is that a dive? Tap sober. Bumps him a little in the box. Well, not every foul is a yellow card. I think the referee is right here. Oh, and it's a free kick here. Penalty shot. Come on, Nana. Oh, what a save. What a guess. Now we counter attack here. Rafina with the ball. Crosses it over, taps over. Nice ball through to Fernandez. He does have Williams with him. Long ball through. Let's get cut off there, unfortunately. Well, we do get a good position here. Williams now with the ball. Tapped over to Holland. Rashford takes a shot. There we have it. 35th minute. 1 0. One hand on the trophy. But what a save by Onana. It's so much action happened after that, that penalty kick. That I didn't get to appreciate that save. Salah's uh, almost automatic in those situations. But he guesses the right way. Salah doesn't put enough power on it. And Man United make him pay. Down the other end the with the man in form, Rashford. What a turn of events, that's for sure. Nandez trying to push up there. Taps over, is coming over, putting a bit of weight into the tackle. As long as he does that outside the box, I'm happy with that. Nandez trying to defend up. Samira does miss it. Martinez does step too far over. Darwin. Darwin Nunez has now tied it up. The bounce back. Liverpool. Return served. We just overcommitted in those defensive uh, attempts and overran the player each time. And then that just opened it up for him. We're now into the second half here. Fernandez cuts it off. A nice clearance through to Williams. Let's find Holland. He does have Rashford with him. Beautiful pass through. Rashford. Oh, saved by the keeper. And Holland couldn't finish it off. Robertson slides across field. 
He is. Oh, again. Martinez. Oh, Onana with the save. About to say, Martinez with again getting in front, blocking. The guy has saved so many goals for us doing that. But let's bring on Carrera. Bring on fresh legs, and the guy is a scoring machine for us. Rafina with the ball. Poor pass there. He comes up, puts defensive pressure on with Rashford now. Nice play there. Rashford. Got Carrera with him. Take shot. Talk about scoring machine. He has just potentially secured the FA Cup for Man United. The domestic treble. Got two minutes left. Just got on the field as well. What a signing he has been. Rashford delays, delays, waits for the defender to come across. And you're just not going to stop Carrera from there. Fantastic goal. And ball through here to Rashford. Oh, can he make it a third here? Oh, saved. Saved by the keeper. Almost similar things to our Premier League match. We're ending this match with a free kick. Or oh, coin kick, sorry. Fernandez taking a power shot, but it ricochets off. And Liverpool do clear it out. And there we have it. Your FA Cup winners, Man United. What a couple of weeks it is for them. Carabao Cup winners earlier on in the season, but Premier League winners, FA Cup winners. And we all know where we're heading next match. Honestly, just did not expect this at the start of the season. Man United had some good players, but we had to turn over a few. And the guys we brought in, the depth with Elmaz, Mula as well in the second squad. Rafina Williams, phenomenal. There we have it. I honestly think our back line has been the major contributor to us winning. Taps over, Shalotabek and Martinez. The amount of times they get in front of a shot and block it. Sometimes underrated what a defender is to a squad. And we've got three great ones in the back line. And have that, having them, how good they are, gives us the ability to only have three in the back line. It gives us that extra attacker up front. And obviously being able to move Rashford into that centre forward position. Wouldn't be able to do that if our back, back line was struggling defensively. And obviously Casemiro is a big part of that as well, dropping back. There we have it, the winners of the FA Cup. Fantastic. Let's quickly have a look at the match stats on this one. It was pretty even, 54-46 split on possession. Obviously our man of the match, Rashford. He was everywhere, he was great for us. Now the final match of the episode but we will have something special at the end of the episode to kind of recognize some of the plays throughout the season. But we've got the Champions League final against Barcelona. This is gonna be an absolute epic, tough encounter here. But let's see if we can do it. Got the domestic treble. Oh, it'd be fantastic if we could get this Champions League as well. Season one, we're at Wembley. Will prevail. It's Manchester.
Manchester United and they take on Barcelona. It's coming up live next on EA TV. See what we can do. Every top level footballer wants to be after Rashford a looking for a quick start here. Champions nice League play to get around the outside. The He's his quick feet. It's just phenomenal, but he gets it out to Rafinha here. Oh, it would be absolutely fit. <laughs> Didn't even get a chance to finish what I was saying. But Rafinha has scored against his old club in the Champions League final. It could not be any sweeter. Rafina than that. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. What a shot. In the box is equal to it. What a play. What a goal. Oh, that's a memory that's gonna live with him forever. Scoring against his old club in the Champion League final. We could not write a better script for him. And look, we only got uh, got him because the play we wanted, Elisi was going to Barcelona. That was who we were kind of targeting early on in the season. And I thought, you know, a great player. He's going to be sitting on the bench. So let's pick him up, get him in the starting squad, and he's delivered for us. But what a nice ball through there to Rashford. Steps back on the inside here. Sets himself. Saved there. Oh, that could have been two up. Sure, what popped up there, but I think this could be my 50th win Delivering as coach it. as well. Clearance needed to be better. Could be a icing on the cake. Oh, save there. Camavinga with a nice shot. Obviously, versus Barcelona quite a few times. Playing for Real Madrid prior. No, real threat from the cross. no, no, no. Quick play the ball out to Rafina. He's got the pace. Breaking down the outside here, curls it back in, little chip over, and they chip it in the middle, you know Rashford's going to find it, 34th goal of the season, crowd is stunned, we're up 2-0, good shot there, puts enough power on it just to get it past the keeper's hands. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They're bossing the game now. And Fantastic. Just one minute of time added on We're going into half time here, Barcelona. Oh, it's only a 2 0 lead at the moment. Chance to make a game of it Arana here. with the save. Still possibilities. Oh, we've got to defend better than that if we're going to keep this lead, that's for sure. To an end. Barcelona again attacking in the second into half. The we see the man we'll talk about earlier, who's now playing for Barcelona. We get up there, nice well, defensive no play through. there by taps over. Rafina now, nice long Camavinga. ball through to Camavinga, will chip over. On to Tapsoba. Playing a little bit dangerous there, but a nice long ball through to Holland. It's got the pace, nice Can play there. Oh, Ooh, we'll saved by it. the keeper. Nice counter attack, but we did play a little dangerous there. Fernandez trying to get move up there to block. Got his teammate Rafina with him. All into the middle. Torres. Put it off. No, he can't. Putting some pressure on him though. But the ball gets into the box. Taps over, comes over. Nice defensive pressure there, but he does miss the tackle. Oh, Martinez oh, sticks a foot out. Too fussy he just saved us the goal there, Martinez. A Take a bow. Ball Torres. into the middle here. Now with oh, Onana. Well, the keeper has outdone himself. What a save. Rafinha. Ball to Fernandez. Has to get it through. Just couldn't. And, and there we have it. What a play. What a game. What a season. Hope you guys have enjoyed this season. This series. It's been so much fun to play. Guys we brought in. Obviously putting Rashford up front was uh, really one of the best decisions we made. 34 goals for him. 
Holland took a while to kind of get the wheels turning. He started playing better near the back end of the season with Rording Carrera. Hopefully as a backup. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad. Bruno Fernandes getting sore arms from lifting all these trophies. The Champions League Here he goes. Manchester United. The Champions League winners. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment. Man United. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel a couple of unsung heroes, I think. Uh, we were talking um, at the back end of the last match, but uh, Elmaz, Gula, Mount, even. Um, you know, he isn't the most flashy player, but he was great for us this season. He um, scored a, a decent amount of goals, about eight assists, I think it was, as well throughout the series. And Archo, obviously, fantastic player did get moved to the second squad being that we did bring on Williams and Rafina, but he was our ace of spades with Ahmed and uh, Carrera in that in that second squad when needed keep that momentum and we're resting the top stars well, out, the our team won it doesn't happen very often does it these will be photos to cherish for years to come brilliant stuff there we go all four trophies wouldn't have asked for a better end to the season. Bit of a glitch there in the in the graphics. 37-63 split on possession. Rafina, our man of the match, 9.9 .9 against his old club. It's fantastic. And here we have a bit of a recap of it. We beat Inter Milan 3-2. And then we beat 5-3 um, in the quarter finals. Round 16 was against Milan, 3-1. And then we obviously took out that top spot. Fine, uh, Munich was our biggest competitor there. We did lose to them in our first match, but we were able to win the rest. It was fantastic. And there we have it, all four trophies on top of the bus, celebrating with the fans. Coming up after this parade, a bit of a special, a bit of a recap of, you know, the way the season's been, a few awards for players that I think, you know, were outstanding for us. A bit of recognition along the way. So I hope you enjoy this next part, let me know if you do, and we'll look at making it a part of our series coming up. So we've got the Golden Boot Award 23-24 season, and that goes to none other than Marcus Rashford, it was absolutely phenomenal for us, scoring absolute ridiculous goals throughout the season. And, uh, you know, just absolutely on fire, that boot. We got a chance, he was going to score. And there are the stats. 34 goals, 14 assists, 9 clean sheets. Absolutely fantastic out of 39 appearances. Now we've got the Rising Star Award. And this goes to none other than Ahmed. This guy is a star of the future. Actually, Absolutely fantastic with the ball uh, on his feet to score or, you know, set up a teammate. He was setting up Carrera quite a bit. And obviously, um, he can definitely score a goal as well. Uh, so he is our rising star player of the year. And uh, I look forward to seeing what he can potentially achieve in the next season. Because he's definitely going to be pushing for that first squad uh, up front. That's for sure. Um, absolutely phenomenal player. 17 goals, 17 goals, 15 assists, 7 clean sheets on 28 appearances. Now, goal of the year had to be in our Premier League winning match. I thought, you know, this was just a beautiful goal here. What a bicycle kick by Holland. It was hard to pick. There were some phenomenal goals throughout this year. 
Obviously, Rashford was scoring quite a bit of them, shown in the highlights just before. But that bicycle kick was phenomenal. And last but not least, least, our player of the year is none other. You probably already guessed it. Marcus Rashford. He was absolutely a man on fire this season. He was a scoring machine for us, but obviously he also delivered with the assists. But he scored when it counted, stepped up for his squad when we were down by one. And obviously sealed some uh, epic goals uh, to kind of build that momentum. And us obviously push through some of those tough, tough matchups, especially in the Champions League. They really led from up front, obviously with a young striker with him. Uh, so he is our player of the year this season with Man United. Now, obviously, we had those objectives that we had to achieve, and obviously we did, except for the financial side of things, but obviously Man United do not care about the financial sides. Um, so, yeah, we uh, are getting the option to obviously come back next season, but I do want to leave it up to you. Let me know in the comments below. Do we go season two, or do we go with someone else maybe in the championship uh, league? Um, and uh, see what we can do with them and try and get them to the Premier League. Uh, so let me know. Hope you've enjoyed this series, this season, this episode. Make sure you like and subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Once again, thanks for watching.